Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be taking you through my weekend during tier 4 lockdown in the UK. It's February 2021, the weather is cold and wet, and there's not much work for a self-employed massage therapist during this time, so this weekend will be spent relaxing indoors. I start my day by getting up and doing my morning routine. It's 9.30. natural skincare products which you'll see a lot of in the first half of this video. A great toothpaste I'd recommend is Kingfisher Fluoride Free Toothpaste along with the Humble Toothbrush from Humble Co which I'm using right now. After brushing my teeth, I cleanse my face using a gentle cleansing milk. In this video, I use Altia Organic Cleansing Milk, however I've since switched to a cleansing cream that doesn't contain essential oils due to my sensitive skin. After cleansing, I use Witch Hazel to tone and I clean my eyes, my eyebrows and my ears thoroughly. I use eye drops twice a day as my eyes tend to get drier with the indoor heating on full blast. In this video, I used an intensive moisturiser from Faith in Nature. However, I've since switched to an unscented moisturiser from Green People. As I narrate this, most, if not all, of my skincare products are now unscented and free from essential oils. I like to take at least 20 minutes for this routine, as it sets a relaxing tone for the day and helps me feel more awake. After doing my morning routine, I make my bed and lay out my clothes to wear for the day. While I'm showering, let's take a look at some of the products I'm using. I used to use this Nuff Stuff shower gel but found this particular blend to be irritating to my skin due to the essential oils. Plus I don't have eczema so it's questionable why I purchased it in the first place. I usually use Nuff Stuff's unscented gel which doesn't contain essential oils but for some reason I wanted to try something different. It didn't work so now I'm back to using their unscented gel. Apart from shower gel and my hands, I don't use much else when I'm showering or bathing. If I want to exfoliate then I'll use either a loofah or a body brush. During this winter time, I've used Eucerin every other day as I had some extremely dry skin. This particular product is great because it's an oil that turns into a cleansing milk and cleans the skin without further drying it out. 
Now that I've showered, it's time to moisturise. In this video, I used whipped shea butter with coconut oil. However, I've since switched to Alteris Dry Skin Repair Cream, which is much better for dry skin that is also dehydrated. I only use deodorant when I'm going to be around other people. Otherwise, I don't bother because clean sweat doesn't smell bad, and I love embracing the way I naturally smell without the use of artificial fragrances. However, when I do use deodorant, I usually use a salt based spray deodorant from Salt of the Earth, and this one is gently fragranced with watermelon and cucumber. Now that I'm oiled up and ready to go, it's time to get dressed. After this, I'll make breakfast. I'm not bothered to narrate this part of the video, so just enjoy the visuals and music. Hello, my voice is back again. Let's have a little chit chat about lockdown. From March 2020 till now, so much has changed in the world as well as with myself. This has been a tremendous time for spiritual, mental and emotional growth. It's been a time to really look at your life and ask yourself, do I really want that? Am I sure? Am I really sure? Really? Am I? It's been a time to cut out the bullshit, cut out the nonsense and get to the heart of the matter. There is a collective energy of stagnancy. However, you don't have to feed into it if you don't want to. There is a lot of fear mongering going on in mainstream media, but you don't have to buy into it if you don't want to. Life as we know it has definitely changed and as we move through the age of Aquarius, it will continue to do so. My advice is to buckle up, create a plan and implement it. The change you wish to see in the world starts with you. Right, back to the video. Once I've finished my breakfast, I put my dishes in the sink and do an hour of cleaning, tidying and organising. My next video will be a continuation of this one, but it will be in the style of a clean with me motivational video. So if you're interested in that, feel free to go ahead and check it out. Think of these next few clips as a preview of part two. Thank you for watching this video and hopefully I'll see you in the next one.